This is KSL News at 6. Good evening. We begin tonight with developing news coming out of Taylorsville, where a first grade student from Fremont Elementary School has been hit by a car. News specialist Andrew Adams has been on the scene since shortly after it happened, and he joins us live now. Andrew? Dini, we're only standing a couple of hundred yards away from the school. That far lane, that southbound lane, is where the accident happened just a little bit earlier on. Seven-year-old boy who was hit. Chopper 5 captured aerials of the accident scene a little bit earlier. Large response from Unified Police and Unified Fire. Detectives say it appears the boy simply darted into the road and was hit by a southbound SUV. From the witnesses that, that we've talked to so far, they say, yeah, the, the vehicle, the Dodge Durango, was doing what they were supposed to be doing, and there was really nothing that the car could do. Investigators say there were no signs of impairment on the part of the driver. It's unclear why the boy ran out in the road where he did. School was just getting out when it's happened, and crossing guards were at work down the street. Now, the boy was initially listed in critical condition, but since that time, just in about the past 20 minutes or so, we have an update. Sounds like fair condition with broken bones, certainly an upgrade. For now, back to you. Yeah, hoping for the best here. All right, Andrew Adams, live first tonight. Andrew, thank you. Deanie? Well, we've had some.